hey everyone welcome back to the channel so guys in this video i'm going to show you how to fix please contact itunes for to complete this transaction if you're also getting this kind of error on your iphone let me show you how you can fix that okay first of all you need to close that okay after that you need to open iphone settings okay in settings section you need to scroll down and tap on general after that make sure you are not connected with any vpn okay if you're any connected with vpn just remove the vpn and then, then go back after that you can see a person screen showing here language and region tap on that okay make sure when you are creating apple id and select that region make sure both this and other region is same okay if that not same then choose that region when you creating apple id okay if that method not working then move to the next solution the next solution is open safari browser and search here apple sport okay and wait for a few seconds you can see a person screen apple sport showing here select the apple sport and wait for a few seconds okay as you can see showing here all apple things okay now you can see a person screen forget apple id password scroll down and search sport okay after that you select your issue here and then submit it to apple sport okay if that method is also not working and you are still getting that error then move to the next solution the next solution is open iphone settings again in settings section you need to tap on apple id okay after that you need to scroll down and tap on sign out okay wait for a few seconds it will asking your password if you already change your apple id password then change it again and after that log in your apple id again into iphone and fix that issue okay if that method is also not working and you are still facing this kind of error on your iphone then move to the last last one is open iphone settings in setting section you need to tap on apple id after that you can see a person screen showing your personal information okay wait for a few seconds it will take some time to load after that make sure your name and date of birth is correct if it's not correct then make some correction on it and then try to again transaction so friends by do that simple two to three step and applying it on your iphone you can easily fix that error hope this video is helpful for you if the video is helpful for you don't forget to share and subscribe my youtube channel and press the bell icon for upcoming videos notifications thanks for watching